hi guys welcome to my channel and how to download gigabyte motherboard driver so first you have to come this website www.gigabyte.com this is officially website after that you click on search button then enter the model number of motherboard x870 aerus elite wi-fi 7 and ice and then hit enter then click on the product after you can see this is your motherboard just click on it then click on support then select your operating system windows 10 and 11 so both operating system installations process same so guys first download after that show you how to install it so audio driver sd audio driver you can see and click to download LAN driver, a chipset driver, you can see AMD chipset driver and click to download. Then LAN driver, Ethernet driver, Internet driver, you can see and click to download. Bluetooth, Wi Fi, and Bluetooth. So, guys, install always separate driver, Wi Fi different and Bluetooth different. So, click to download and then Bluetooth. Okay, and then USB so click to same and when you click to download now it will start downloading in the download box so it will complete and then click to this icon after it open this folder where it is downloaded and then show you how to install so this is your driver so wait for complete so guys it is completed so first download all driver first select this and right click and extract all and same locations just extract it okay it will open and close it okay this created this folder we can see then info update right click extract all extract and same close it you can then this one right click and extract all one by one do that then this right click extract all and then extract So one by one extract all or your driver. Otherwise you can without extract and you just double click to install. But sometime we get the issues in this last. then it is done and close it then just right click to refresh it so this is your actual driver and this is also your but this is extracted so guys first open this select right click and run as administrator then click on yes
so wait few second this is installing it will take some time okay it will close automatically means this is install it okay it is closed automatically means this is installed then go to back then second one same select and right click to administrator run as administrator and then yes So it is closed automatically means this is installed. Go back, then third one. Just select and right click to run as administrator. Then click on yes. because installations process very simple so it is closed automatically means this is installed then fourth one open select right click to run as administrator then click on yes So it is closed automatically means install and then come to back again. Then fifth one. Same select and right click to run as administrator. Then click on yes. So it is closed automatically means this is installed then back then second last this one and this is last so open this select right click to run as administrator after that click on yes So it is closed means this is installed back and last one graphic driver just open it and the same select and right click to run as administrator
then click on yes so this is installing driver this is graphic card driver display driver monitor driver you can say that so it will take some take take some time after install the all driver then restart your system okay restart so important for your system after install the driver okay thank you